Wah, how do you quick stop? Wah, I don't know how to quick stop. Yo, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing y'all how to quick stop in NBA 2K25. Um, surprisingly, there's a lot of people that don't know how to quick stop still. Um, so I'm gonna go over the three, four kind of different ways to quick stop in this game. Um, and how to be able to green after uh running and you feel me dribbling so um if you ever played nba 2k21 it's very very similar damn near the exact same way to quick stop in 2k21 um so let's just get right into it right so if i'm running in, in a certain direction the first way i'm gonna teach you how to quick stop is opposite bow hand quick stopping opposite bow hand quick stopping is if i'm running to the right and I want to quick stop like that. Boom. What you're going to be wanting to do is since I'm running to the right, you're going to stop holding. Okay, so to run, you're holding R2 or RT, right? And you're running to the right. Boom. To quick stop, what you're going to want to do is let go of every button, right? That's the first thing you want to do. Run and let go of every button. All right. As you can see, the animation is too slow to quick stop and to shoot off of because if you try to shoot off of it, it makes you do a fade like that, which is ugly as shit. Right? So, boom. What you want to do is run, hold on to, let go of everything, then flick opposite bow hand. Since I'm running to the right, I'm going to flick my right stick to the left once I let go of R2 and let go of my left stick too. So, I'm no longer running in any certain direction. So, I'm running R2, R2, let go, flick left, and boom. You flick opposite bow hand. Since I'm running to the right, I'm gonna be flicking my right stick to the left, and it's gonna give me this animation right here, starting a dribble move. But what you wanna do is shoot right as the animation is starting, and you get kind of like this gather or like kind of an angle that he's moving towards the opposite direction, and that's when you wanna shoot instead of getting that animation and shooting a dribble pull up so i'm gonna be holding r2 i'm running to the right let go of everything flick the left and it gets like this quick step it's like a quick step quick stop instead of like chewing the dribble pull up like you would normally right this is opposite ball hand quick stopping and you can do it the same way going to the left if i'm holding r2 going to the left i let go of everything flick to the right with my right stick and get a quick stop. I'm gonna show you guys the animation again. Boom. Okay. Feel me? Stop. Flip to the right. Boom. It's quick stopping. That's how you quick stop. Opposite ball hand quick stopping. Now I'm gonna get into another quick stop, right? Another way to quick stop is just flicking up on the right stick. Flicking up on your right stick, or yeah, flicking up on your right stick starts up the combo, right? Depending on your combo, it might be better or not, but I'm not sure if that changes. I don't think it changes anything at all, actually. But if I'm running to the right, it's the same thing as the opposite ball hand quick stopping. Just instead, you're flicking straight up. Now, what the difference is with straight flicking straight up is when you're shooting off of it, it gives you a longer jump shot timing especially if you're not running straight like see if i'm running straight up the court and then i flick straight up it's an immediate stop and the jump shot timing is as if you were standing still right but if you're running to the left or right and you flick up most of the time you get like a longer jump shot animation and the green window is going to be at a later time in the jump shot if that makes sense me I kind of like, I, I prefer flicking straight up. I always, no matter where I'm going, flick straight up. Because I'm so used to, one, flicking straight up is easier. Instead of thinking of opposite ball hand, you gotta, I'm going right, so I got to flick. You feel me? I got to flick this certain direction. You feel me? If it doesn't matter what direction I'm going, I'm flicking up. You know what I'm saying? It's just so much easier. But also, I got used to the jump shot animation being prolonged. For me, it gives me more time to time it right. You know what I'm saying? Um, for me, it feel like I, I get more time to time it correctly. If you go practice and run right and flick, 
you're gonna feel it you're gonna feel that your jump shot animation or timing is gonna be longer it's gonna be you're gonna your green window is gonna be at a long, later date than regular so let's practice right um so i'm going I'm running to the right stop everything flick up and shoot immediately feel me flick and that's the animation get it's con it's let me show you the different animations so this is just flicking up right this is gonna be flicking up and then this is opposite ball hand you see the difference in the animation this is opposite ball hand this is opposite ball hand this is flicking straight up this is flicking straight up and in my opinion flicking straight up is better But it does like right there it makes your animation your jump shot animation a little longer and kind of prolongs your jump shot in in some type of way and i think it's better because it just gives me more time to really see where i'm at in my shooting animation and make sure that i'm good enough. Feel me? another way to quick stop is um depending on your depending on your um like you're behind the back my uh my step back or behind the or yeah my step back is Luka Doncic so I get this long prolonged like step back but I know if you put Devin Booker it kind it's kind of like behind the back when he does his step back and off that dribble move you could quit you could quick stop with so you would be running a certain direction you would still be holding R2 and flick down your right stick and it kind of gives like a 2k20 when you used to flick both sticks down, I'm gonna show you exactly what the animation looks like. It kind of looks like a 2K20 quick stop from yeah, from like when you would flick both um, both your left and right stick down, and it would do like a super fast quick stop. I think my game just crashed. What a weird place for my game to crash, bro. We're gonna spawn right back, so it's cool. Let me put this animation on so I can show you exactly what I'm talking about. Now, now the the um, opposite ball hand and flicking straight up is a way to quick stop with any dribble animations. Doesn't matter. Um, but this 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 quick stop I'm about to show y'all right now. I can only do a certain Let me show y'all right now. My animations. And I'm pretty sure it's step back. Cool. Devin Booker. Boom. This right here when he like pulls the, the like throws the ball behind his back. I'm gonna use Devin Booker step back. And I'm gonna show you how to quick stop off. Alright, so we back in here. Get a ball. So Devin Booker step back looks like this. So I had Luka Doncic on, but this is Devin Booker step back. This is what it looks like. He throws the ball behind his, behind his, behind his back. So if you're running left to right and you flick straight down, you can quick stop straight off of that. And it kind of looks like the 2K20 step back or quick stop. I mean, um, ready to work, coach. Bro, Sorry, so not running up, drills bro. today. Leave me alone, six feet. Like, bro, I don't know if you got COVID game. Look, so you're gonna be running left flick. You're, you're not, you're not like going, letting go of anything but your left stick. So, so boom, you're gonna be running right. You let go of your left stick, left stick, and flick straight down. You're still holding R2. Hold R2, run left, let go of left stick, flick down. So that's how you do, how you do the quick stop. And then once you do, once you get that down, you can just shoot straight off of it. Feel me? Running, let go, flick down. In a weird animation, but because he was in the way, but you can quick stop straight off of it. Boom, run it left, flick down, quick stop, boom, shot. I think we could do it up the court too, but it might give a different animation actually. If you run up the court, do it. Nah, actually, yeah, it is the same animation running up the court. So 
You could even do a running up the court, fast break, quick stop, bow. Easy, feel me? So that's how you quick stop the NBA 2K25 in, in different ways, feel me? Depending on your dribble moves. Um, my prefer just fucking up on my race stick as a quick stop. Like I said earlier, if this video helped you out at all, leave me a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Also hit the bell so every time we make a video, you guys know about it first.